I had to skip the cinematic just so that we can uh, pause and save. You remember this iconic scene? I shot it right in his ass right there. Excellent. Commencing takeoff in semi-auto mode. He's gonna die, isn't he? Nah. He's gonna wish he was, was dead, though. <laughs> <laughs> This kind of space launch once required days of preparation. Solus has been conducting test flights almost every day for the last six months. So in case uh, thanks, right. yeah, so, so in case we don't remember or in case you don't remember, our audience doesn't remember. We killed Sundowner, the doc was coming over to pick up the brains that were left in the facility. And Sundowner was like, Oh, by the way, the president's gonna go get killed in like Saudi Arabia. But there was no way to get there fast enough un until, you know, insert uh, us trying to get to Solus so that we can get there fast enough. Who else? The flight pattern suggests unmanned MQ 320s. Ah, boy. Oh, man. I'm getting chased by drones. Shit. This is a Shit. Our defensive options are limited. Now they're just being nasty. <laughs> <laughs> okay, question of the day. Do you, do you prefer when they say missiles or missiles? That's a good question. I don't know. Like, yeah. missiles to me sounds... It's like tomato tomato kind of thing. Uh huh. Uh, but personally, missiles to me is, is much more better. It sounds less, uh... Crunchy. <laughs> Let's Frenchy. <laughs> Frenchy. Oh, get the missiles. Oh, get the missiles. And they say Germans. We'll say Germans are. Oh, they're pretty funny, all right. I like the little boy that goes into the the weed cave. Oh my God, the weed cave. <laughs> <laughs> no, little German boy, do not go into the weed cave. Ah, the cave is full of bloomed and smoke. Hey, how did he do that? Sci-fi. Right. Bring the chopper around. He's controlling the the plane with with a sword. I I I don't know how else to tell you this, man. <laughs> Ooh. I will say, this part's pretty badass. Like cheese. <laughs> like a hot metallic cyborg knife through butter. Put the cooking mama thing where she's like, oh, good job. <laughs> I put it right at the t right at the end yeah, right <laughs> of, that the end. of that screenshot. <laughs> Mama's proud. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. Uh, is this idiot really gonna jump into the blades of the chopper? No. He's gonna have to jump yeah, sideways into the chopper. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. My chin. <laughs> that was a close shave. Get it? <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, Raiden. Uh oh. <laughs> the one realistic things that the one realistic thing that happens in this game. Uh, right that. Yes, fly lower. Oh, That's it. RPGs. That's it. Run right into this RPG. <laughs> I am sorry, my friend. Your sacrifice will not be forgotten. I'll write it. <laughs> Laters. <laughs> Smell you later, loser. And now we're here. <laughs> now we're here. And we made this hole. Denver. Denver sucks. <laughs> Denver. <right> su <laughs> Denver sucks. Gatorade is better. <laughs> <laughs> Get it. Look who ain't going back to his family. 
Guess who's coming home in, well, Tupperware? <laughs> <laughs> Some really, really shady boxes. <laughs> I don't remember ordering any Amazon packages. Oh my god. Hey, look, it's Daddy's watch! <laughs> Why would he send it to us, Mom? <laughs> That's a little knickknack I gave him from last Christmas. Wait, what's he doing it. sending it back? <laughs> the gov like the government didn't have the heart <laughs> The government didn't have the heart to tell them, so they just said like he went out for milk. I'm <laughs> <laughs> gonna go visit your your aunt and uncle. You just get those brains out. Uh, we're not, we're not for a pack of smokes yeah, while I'm base, dear. I'm not coming back. <laughs> ah, the young lady's company, yeah? How fortunate they are in Colorado, too. Yeah, yeah. Colorado. It should take more than two hours with a set of wheels. Guess I'll just have to borrow some. A lot of cars got abandoned when the evac order came down. But oh, won't the roads be blocked? If you are struck by one of those missiles, or... I know. Missiles. Let me just worry about putting some distance between me and World Wait, wait, wait. He said missiles there. But he said missiles he said the missiles first time. First time. No, no, no. Don't don't be doing this to me, man. I, I don't know, man. I don't know what to tell you. Alright. Chicken sentries are back. It's E, did it? Oh, shit. No. Hang on. I want to try to stealth one of them. <laughs> it's just an inconspicuous box with a sombrero, senor. I don't like the way it walks. Oh, like on its tippy toes? His little tippy toes. His little dainty tippy toes. Hang on. <laughs> Yoink. There we go. Nice. Get him. <laughs> he says. No, but no, no dead friend over here. Just an inconspicuous box with a sombrero, senor. No, no, don't come this way. Don't come this way. It'd be funny if it just runs up to you and just kicks the box. <laughs> Look, a box! It's just like, I hate this box. <laughs> Oh my god, there's this bit where, uh, oh my god, there's this bit, some guy animated this bit where basically, uh, it's Snake, he base he's like, he's on base, and then all of a sudden he's hiding, like, from a bunch of, I just want to take a moment to appreciate this. Wow, it's high. <laughs> Anyways, uh... Basically, he's hiding from a bunch of soldiers, and then he goes into his cardboard box, and then all of a sudden, like, these two soldiers show up in the room, and it turns out they're actually yeah, meeting there because they want to, like, you know, fuck each other. Oh my god. And he's basically just like, oh my god, they don't know I'm here, but, like, they're basically having sex on top of this box. <laughs> <laughs> I mean... I guess they're doing it in their own time. How unfortunate they didn't know. How unfortunate, but, like... <laughs> That's all I ask for, is that you, you take the time. You take the time, but it's like, take oh no, time. Snake, you were in the wrong place the wrong time there, bud. That's his fault. <laughs> <laughs> I was just doing some espionage and they started fucking on top of my box. <laughs> what? Why am I pulling out the box? All right, where, look, where the fuck oh, are these oh. guys? Oh, hi. I just, I just split that tree like nothing. Oh, fuck me. I like how you can do that, but you can't, like, break other buildings and other glass. You know what, dude? That's dude. the video game logic that I hate. If you're gonna make shit that, like, gets destroyed, like, make sure you add a lot more. Yeah, but then Except again... me, who's not a game dev at all, and have no real knowledge of the implications of how to properly do... You know, <laughs> destroyable environments. Right, how to do collapsible or cuttable environments. Because honestly, like this shit right here, this is like ahead of its fucking <laughs> time, dude. Because <laughs> what? It's like. Whew. Hang on. Nice oh, one. Hang on, hang on. Let me get through. Okay, hang on. Let's, let's do this. Watch. Right, hurry. 
It may be an RLB, but it still needs time to accelerate and decelerate for oh, yeah. cosmic velocity. Like the fact that I can actually do this. Like that's yes. impressive, especially like for PS3, you know. Yeah. Can you do that to that planter? Probably can. It's kind of an angle. See? Hey, all right. Hey. Good. I good, good, good. Can you do that to the street sign over there? Oh, the blue one? Yeah. Let's find out. Shake off that baby. Yes, I can. All right. Okay, good. All right. You got points. All right, all right. Now kill the babies. <laughs> now kill the three-armed bastards. Ah, you'll just be nasty. It's a one piece I, just, I destroyed that sign, but I... Hit you destroyed guy. everything but the baby. <laughs> Whoa, I dodged that by a hair! By a pinky. Hey! Oh. I ta, I ta. We must, we must free this. I know, I, I can't that. either. Who would censor that, Courtney? I mean, my god! <laughs> Help me! Help me! Bruh. <laughs> Bro. For fuck's sake. There we there go. There it is. There it is. Go back to the picture. What do you want? <laughs> uh, put a picture of, uh... Of Richie on there. Just Richie. <laughs> put his face over the lady, actually. Oh my god, do you still have the- <laughs> Do you still have the picture of, like, him with the white bag over his face? Oh, I sure do. Send it to me. We'll use that. <laughs> we'll use that one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, babies! God, we, we had so much fun with that stupid bag. For context, uh, we we got a little white uh, plastic paper bag, drew little eyes on it, put it over our heads like idiots. It was fun. Uh, we were all grown ass people. <laughs> yeah, we were like we, we were what in high school when that grown -ass happened. Man. Yeah, no, I was in college at that though. Oh, no, that's hey. right. You and I were both in college. It was, it was college shenanigans, so. Yes. Out. Everyone's stupid in college. I don't care how smart, what kind of doctrine you're going for, you're fucking stupid in college. No matter what. That's true. Sorry, I don't make those rules. Get it! Ah, uh. oh, I did. Oh, yeah, I missed that I juice. I missed it. I missed the juice. I mean, I like to eat it. I was gonna say, like, you don't really need it, but... Still, it's nice and refreshing. Everyone gets thirsty, you know? Stupid chicken. Uh. Get over here! Maybe, uh... Like Damn it! it up. <laughs> I, was it up. I was off by a little bit, but oh well, fuck it. Baby! In a box. It's like three babies' arms holding an apple. A tripod. A tripod, if you will. They're actually called tripods. Yeah. Break the stand. I want violence. What? Whoa! <laughs> what the? Bro, how's all the stuff still on there? You know, they just don't make them like they used to, man. Get out of here. <laughs> Go on, get out of here. Located the route with relatively light security. Relatively, relatively light security. Oh, there's, there's a, a man. Okay. There's a man. There there is a, there's a guy right there, but there's also like there's also a hostage over there as well. Oh, you know what to do. I do. You know exactly what to do. Hang on, let me let me, let me time this cuz I need what do I need? I need the jamming grenade. I need this. EMP activated. Don't fuck it up. Please don't kill me. <laughs> <laughs> I was... Uh, I... 
Oh, they killed him. Shit! Oh, nope, they killed him. Nice. Okay. okay. So basically, I have to kill this guy and then do the MP thing. I will mark the heading on your solid on radar. Please don't kill me, kill man. Escape from Denver. Damn it! Oh. You it's fucked like, it up. Man. Fucked it up. Hang on. We're gonna be here a while, folks. <laughs> Two hours later. Just for just for me, just blow them all up. Just throw our actual real S grenade and blow them all up. You're gonna fuck <laughs> it up. Might as well have fun. That's because that's the thing. Like, I t like if I throw the grenade, it's gonna kill the hostage as well. Do we that's do we even one. care? Because we did strip a guy already. We could strip another man. I mean, that's true. We could strip another dude. Thank you, and then rip his clothes off. All right, hold on. Let's do this. So remember that guy from Legend of Zelda that says, "Thank you." Please don't kill me. <laughs> you know who I'm talking about? I like, think like I he do. lives in a boat. He pops up in Breath of the Wild too. Beetle, that's his name. How the fuck did I forget? Ah, fuck's sake! What, uh, what, what button is it? Okay, it's right tab. Hang on. Please don't kill me. Oh. Get off. Like the juice. Then. I was. I was. I was. God damn it! Uh, what? God damn it! I need to go the other way. Fuck! Throw the grenade. Just fuck it up. I will mark the heading on your soul. As I'm saying, like, do you like, do you want the guy to die? Let's do it. Fuck that man. All right, fine. Hang on. Here we go. Why'd you disobey the oh, so he's dead. Ah, oh, dang it. Hang on. No, no, no. I want you to kill him with the grenade. Okay, fine. Fine. Just for you. Just for me. I've located the route with relatively light security. I will mark the. Alright, great. On your solid on radar. Please don't kill me. Son of a <laughs> <laughs> you fucked that up! I don't know! <laughs> My dude. Alright. I will mark the heading on your solid on radar. Please don't kill me. Alright. Oh. You're not gonna kill ya. But this man is a <laughs> will. They're not gonna kill ya. But I am. Oh my god. Why did he turn around so slowly? Did the grenade even go off? No. Because I did throw it. You saw me throw it, right? D yes. Put another grenade. <laughs> I just softball threw that grenade. Uh-oh. You right, little... I need to get rid of this fucking thing, because this is what's really just driving me nuts. You kept us from stripping a dude! You hear me?! Die, John. And the juice. And the juice. Where's the other guy? There he is. Death is only the beginning. Right. I will join you in Pakistan. I We're going to Pakistan. Pakistan. We're going to Pakistan. Oh, there the reminds me actually. Take a picture. Mm. Oh, it didn't work. Oh, uh, no, it didn't work. The gorilla got you. Well, I'll show you right now what it is, or what, like what it does. <laughs> little silly, silly sounds that you do every time. Every time it's a gorilla, you do little silly sounds. Oh, the Sumuruwa? Yeah, that's my favorite. Same. We'll put little like extra sounds. Oh, like every time it gets hit. Yeah. There you go. You got it. 
tasty. With the Monster Hunter like life for punishments. Uh, you know which one I'm talking about. Is it the the one where you drink a potion? I'll, uh, I'll see if I can. E I'll see if I can even get it, honestly. But yeah, sure. Do it. All right, hold on. Like, now, okay. So these three D photo frames. Uh huh. What ends up happening is that you throw one, and then. Uh, okay. It's a little three D model of a hot chick, right? The thing is uh -huh. that when the cyborgs see them, uh, they like they they go up to they and they go like, no, no, they go up to and they're like, ooh, <laughs> and pretend like nobody's looking, and then. Do I start jerking off? No, but they basically just check it out. <laughs> it's funny. Well, how horny do you gotta be, man? It's like, hey, man, cyborgs need a little bit of love too, you know? You know what I'm saying? Y'all know what I'm saying, my fellow sir. Oh, yeah, what? that's right. What the? It's a little Easter egg. It's oh, no. Fruit Ninja! Oh, I actually like that there's like a rind to it. That's cool. Yeah. <laughs> it's crazy, it's right? It's a Japanese sport of cutting watermelon at the beach. Right? Except we're not blindfolded. What is that? Is that just like the Japanese version of a piano? I want to say it is. I mean, oh, the winner gets, I don't know, fruit. <laughs> oh, the winner gets watermelon. Watermelon is its own reward. Yeah, but imagine if you fuck it up and you just, instead of like cutting it in half, you just like smash it. Just, it's all like on the sand and everything. Oh god, this is gross. Exactly. They didn't think about that, did they? Seems like it. You have passed the last of the barricades. And that's something I've always wondered. Like, why would they bust it on the like the beach sand? You know, because like if they hit it with a bat, that's that's not gonna slice. That's going to splatter. Exactly. Uh oh. That should do nicely. We got a set of wheels. It's a beetle, isn't it? No, it's not. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> that would have been funny if you got on a beetle. <laughs> a smart uh -oh. car. There you go. I need your bike. Thank you for your cooperation. And then he left his number freaking etched into the ground, man. <laughs> God damn. Raiden, you can't be doing that. No, we did shit this Combat moment. rank C? Yeah, you yeah, <laughs> get your ass by the... <laughs> uh, I, I always hated that one, but it, oh well. Like, like we tried. And I'm not gonna. We tried. And I'm not gonna like like. Yeah. Okay. First, let me un <laughs> let me untie my tongue a little bit. It's like we tried, and I'm not gonna let the audience just sit through that, you know, for freaking ever. <laughs> All right. Hold up. Hold up. Hold we up. could. I mean, we could. Do we want to? Maybe. We could. But no. No. We're not doing that. No. 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 All right. You are far too precious to be put to this kind of misery. So we'll do it ourselves. <laughs> yes. On our own time. On our own time. I'll probably release it like in a short or something if we manage to successfully do it <laughs> later on down the road. <laughs> <laughs> so let's replay that level and see if we can strip that man. Strip every man and the entire playthrough. We've just got to find every single opportunity and make sure we do it right. God, we got to dedicate like a day to that. But we'll do it. Because we can because we can do like level... Like after we're done with this, we can... Do like an episode where we just do like level select, find the guys, strip them, and then just do it. I I'm pretty sure I could look up a comprehensive guide on how to do it every time. Somebody must have done it flawlessly. Oh yeah, no, that well that's how I found out about the the other guy. Like to use like the electrostatic grenade. So that, I'm sure there's a way. I'm sure there there is a way. But anyways, uh, I mean, there's nothing much else to customize. We like we got the we got the health, we got the fuel cells, we got the infinity wig. Do we? Ah, uh, you need another weapon. I mean, we can do bloodlust, which is the sundowner's weapon. We can do dystopia, which is uh, what's his name, Ty uh, monsoon's weapon. This one's not that great. All it does is basically just throws the sigh out and then calls it back forward. It just hits once. That's it. 
This is basically like a really heavy attack. It's slow as balls. It deals oak. It deals damage, but it's still just slow as balls. Now let's wait till we get to you know who. Yeah, because like these two, uh, the Fox Blade and Murasama. This is what I'm waiting for. Mm. But anyways, oh, yeah. I think we're done for now. Let's go on to the next episode. Let's go on to the next video. Or the, call the next, the next video. Wait, is it the next video? No, it's the next uh, b -b 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 chapter. Sorry, next level. I don't know why, but it kind of feels out of place that he's like riding that motorcycle. I'm not yeah, saying like it's not bad. In the middle of the road, too, like a fucking idiot, dude. Like you don't own the goddamn streets just because you're the only one. I mean, it is riding, dude. I, am out of Colorado. I don't give a shit. <laughs> it's like the goddamn road. That's true. Wait, like, don't get me wrong. Imagine, if I like a, imagine like a like a fucking like a a family van is like going on the other side. You have to swerve around this fucking idiot. <laughs> I mean, don't get me wrong. They're Raiden's, also stupid. I mean, because Raiden's cool, the bike's cool, but the two of them together just—I don't know. I don't know what it is. Wait, they're in Pakistan already? No, they're they're getting out uh, of Colorado. Okay, I was about to say like. Holy shit, he rode all the way to Pakistan from Colorado? <laughs> In less than an hour? Uh-oh. He has his own dog. No, it's it's Wolf. I, having a little heart to heart, I have analyzed his words and actions. I am unable to ascertain his motivation. Motivation. Uh, fancy meeting you here. Wow, in the middle of the road. I, call I suppose I should thank you for not killing everyone at the launch site. <laughs> well, not if you say it like that. For a hired killer, you're not very good at your job. Raiden, he chopped off your arm and your eye. Like, the guy <laughs> kicked your ass. <laughs> it's all those contracts. Speaking of ass. I'm not talking about That's money, true. Jack. I'm talking ideals. Excuse me. Ideals. Excuse me. Forget it. Memes, just Jack. Be nasty. Memes, Jack. Memes. Stop being nasty and just enjoy the memes. <laughs> will decide who's right. End of story. Okay, so this whole level is just a boss fight with Jetstream Sam. Really? Yeah. Oh my god. Good, they take it out. Don't, bro, park your fucking car not on the road. <laughs> it's not a car. Killing you. Huh? Sorry, the oh, vehicle. <laughs> Why, that's very good. Yes, I like that. Yes, I like that. Must you really fight? They're fighting over the dog. If you win, I like keep him. Don't interfere. If I win, I keep him. <laughs> Just like bent. Oof! I don't like that shot. Between us. Oh yeah, nice it's cast. Like, it's like the old west, but with swords. Ah yes. Ends here. Okay. Let's okay. dance. Hanzo. Hanzo. Out and by the side of the road. I'm telling you, there's like a little family van driving right now. Just like beep beep. Children are pointing the rub little fingers up the window, and they're like, "Mommy, mommy, look! Two ninjas are fighting. I think one of them's Mexican." <laughs> He's actually Brazilian. Really? Is that Spaniard accent? I think so. Like, I know, like, I want to say he's Brazilian, but I think he's actually Mex- But I don't know if he's actually Mexican or not. What the fuck? He's Show fighting me, me without a sword. I know you just disarmed me, but... Oh, shit! Ouch. 
You didn't walk right into it. You fucking Akuma glided over. <laughs> okay, so like when in this phase, I either have to outrun him and basically just do hit and run. Because for some whatever reason, I can't block it. Oh, I can! Oh, never mind! You idiot. <laughs> oh, that's right. Oh. <laughs> Alright, Geese Howard, shit. Yeah, I block this oh, and then let him recover and then do the hit and run. Uh huh. He right, lets him go over. pick it up. <laughs> okay. Ooh, what the hell? Is that why they call him Jetstream Sam? He just farts. Jet propulsion farts. I He's mean. That that Make sure it's the reverb one, because <laughs> that's a lot of power behind those. That's true. Watch. Oh wait, that's not it. All right, come at there me, bro. <laughs> There it is again! Ugh. Pretty boy! He's doing far more better than I anticipated. Wait, is his health bar the, the little yellow one or the yeah, other one? one? The yellow one. That's new. That's... How do you do that? How do you do that? You know, I don't know. There it I is. think he carved. I think he carved up the the rocks, and then all of a sudden. Can't just do that. Playtime's over. All right, great. And that's it. That was Jetstream Sam. Oh my god, my tummy, it hurts. Uh, uh, what is this red stuff? So this is what it feels like to lose. You get to keep the puppy. You get to keep the dog. <laughs> now I'll behead him like the rest of them. <laughs> nah, he's got my respect. He is dead. Wow, nice deduction, though. had any cyborg enhancements? Was yeah. This outcome necessary? So, if you heard what he said, like. Sam, like, most, like, he was mostly human. He, he didn't have a whole lot of cyborg enhancements on him. And he was still able to compete with Raiden. Lol. That just means Raiden's a piece of shit. <laughs> well, Raiden got good, but, like, Sam was already good, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> but, yeah. Taking this, yoink! Shut up, dog. Indicates Sam inherited the sword from his father. Going to bury it? I will retain it in memory of Sam. Give it back to his dad. If he's still alive. If he's still alive. I can't believe this thing needed fucking batteries. <laughs> How did a Mexican end up with a samurai sword? That's what I want to know. <laughs> yeah, give it to the doggy. Give it to the dog. Right, we have less than one hour. Hurry! Roger that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, whatever. 
Quit fucking, Bro, run, what quit fucking run with your boyfriend and get to Pakistan already. <laughs> so now he's gonna run to Pakistan now. Uh, now he's gonna run to Pakistan, yeah. <laughs> hey! Hey! <laughs> Alright, buddy. Well. One kill. <laughs> We got one. We got one chapter left, dude. It's gonna get spicy. Yeah, and we're already running up our. Uh, well, we're gonna record for thirty-seven minutes, but like I gotta call it here because it's almost ten o'clock my time, and I, I gotta go to bed early, bro. Oh man, that's right. You and your fucking nine to five. Nine sorry, to no. five. Sorry, no, no, eight to five. I'm sorry. Eight to wow, sorry. Eight to five. It's like the rest of us wage slaves. <laughs> I'm sorry that I have bills to pay and have to be an adult with a job. <laughs> I have to go to work. Cavemen's are laughing at us right now. Cavemen's are laughing at us right now. <laughs> All right, They're rolling around in their stone graves. <laughs> Do they even have... Like, well, that's the thing. Like, Did they have stone graves? Because I feel like they would have just been like, oh, dig hole, throw in there. That's it. Yeah, that's exactly what they did. I think there, there's like early, early like, sign that they're they're smart enough to bury their dead. And all they did was just bury a hole, like dig a hole in the ground, and they just throw them in. <laughs> not our, not our like fully realized monkey forms. Those, those just I don't know. They probably ate the dead ones. <laughs> for <laughs> all we know, probably. Like, you know, if we take the bones of the dead ones, we can use them as clubs. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's how you realized. And that's when you realize that the 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 the, skull, the the club with the skull on it was probably that guy using the skull of his best friend to bludgeon animals so he so for hunting. <laughs> you would do that if I were to die, right? I mean, I probably wouldn't turn it into a club. I'd probably turn it into a sick piece of armor, though. <laughs> <laughs> a fucking. A Halloween decoration every year. <laughs> oh God, no! Oh man, these these bones things that you set up on the table with the nacho dip and the like they seem so crispy treats over there. They look real. What yeah, dude, you like, source these. Uh, oh, you know, got them on Craigslist. A friend of mine. Yeah, I know. They got them from a friend of mine. <laughs> he was willing to. He was happy to volunteer. <laughs> <laughs> they laugh. They're like, ha ha, that's so funny. No, really, where did you get them? I'm like, no, I told you, I got them from a friend. I'm not saying which one though. He insisted. <laughs> he insisted. <laughs> this was his uh oh, like this is something this is something he wished for. You know what I would do? I would keep your skull and just put the biggest like plastic nose on it. <laughs> that's how I know that's how I know it's you. Oh my god. You know probably uh, what's with the skeleton with the giant nose? Oh that's my friend. Oh, that's my friend. He's my best that's friend. <laughs> Yo, actually, before we go, I heard a little story about like how some person wanted uh, their skull to be like uh, you know cleaned and everything, uh -huh. and then put two uh, sapphires or like blue gems in his eyes. Oh my god! <laughs> and uh, something like that. He and wanted then, like, to be turned into a treasure skull. Sunlight. Yeah. Dang, that's metal as hell. I want like the three D eyes, uh, one blue, one red. That'd be cool. Oh, that'd be crazy. Actually, you know what this reminds me of? Okay, real quick before we do go. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Hot was, conversations happen, the boys. There, there was this, there was this guy that he before, like before he died, he said that like he put in his will that he wanted to donate his body to science. But after that, they were done with his body for the like for the body farm. Um, he wanted his bones to be displayed, like in a museum, with the bones of his uh, of his of his favorite dog, so that they would always be together. Oh! And to this day, like there, like I, I want to say it's the Smithsonian, but I'm not sure. But there is a skeleton in the anatomy section of this museum that it's that guy, and it's uh, and it's the dog, the the bones of his and the skeleton of his dog, and they're doing the pose. Uh, they're doing this pose of what, like, of a picture they took together, and the picture is right there next to the actual uh, frame. Oh, that's cool! Holy yeah, shit. I was just like, oh, like he wanted, he wanted to be with his best bud, you know. Dan, do you think he was married? I don't know. I don't think he was actually. <laughs> I oh, really yeah, don't think he was, considering how much he loved that dog. 
Imagine though, like you're married, you have a wife, you have like seven kids and shit like that, and then you die, and the, the one thing you want to do is be you, like, you, is be displayed with your dog. <laughs> with the dog. <laughs> <laughs> that dog was more a companion than you ever were, Cheryl. You bitch. <laughs> That's, right. that's a dick move. <laughs> it really is. Maybe. Or a Chad move. I don't know. I just, I, I, it's a weird flex, but okay, man. <laughs> weird flex, man. But woo. <laughs> Off you go. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please be sure to like, share, comment, subscribe. Follow us on social media. Um, if you haven't already, uh, ch check us out on Twitter. Check us out on Instagram. And uh, we'll, see, like, we'll check you all later in the next one, man. Like, we're, like, we're almost done with Metal Gear. Oh, man. Oh, man, I can't wait. <laughs> <laughs> gonna be good. Oh, hell yeah, dude. We're we're nearing that grand finale. All right, it's gonna get nasty. <laughs> See ya. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. <laughs>